Hello everybody and welcome to the wonderful town of Tokyo uh, in Japan. Uh, we've been here for a couple of days now. We're in Tokyo for maybe 36 hours, 48 hours, something like that. We've been over to Hakone in the countryside and now we're back here. And um, the only camera I've brought with me for this trip is my trusty X100F. Uh, obviously the X-T3 which I'm filming on but I'm not taking stills with that. The X100F is my camera of choice for street photography. But I feel that over the last eight months or so, especially with the GFX 50R, that I haven't really used this camera that much, so I made a conscious decision to just bring this camera with me all the way to the other side of the world. So I'm going to be shooting all over the place with this camera. We've been, we've already been to Hajuki. Shinjuku. Shinjuku. <laughs> we've already been to Shinjuku, uh, Shibuya, and uh, various other places. And Shinjuku last night was uh, very interesting actually because it rained, it rained quite heavily. And one of the interesting things I find about Japan is that everything just works, everything clicks, everything seems to have a reason. And one of those things that I noticed last night was that everybody seemed to have transparent umbrellas, like everybody. Maybe one or two not, but pretty much everybody had exactly the same umbrella. There's probably a reason for that. Most things in this country happen for a reason. It's usually to help things move along, to flow, to stop any kind of uh, conflict or anything like that. And it's, uh, it's a very interesting thing to see. Okay, so we're now in uh, Shibuya, which is uh, actually fairly close to where our hotel is. And one of the things I wanted to mention was that, as I said in a previous video, which I'll link above here, I shoot pretty much everything in a black and white film simulation, even if I'm shooting raw. And the reason for that is because you can see the light better, or certainly I can see the light better, the shadows, the highlights, the fall off, the tones. So even, you know, obviously in Japan, we have all of this beautiful color everywhere. And I think it's important to capture that color. So I. On this trip, I'm shooting RAW plus JPEG. The JPEGs will be in black and white because that's how I want to see through the viewfinder. But then I have the luxury of being able to edit those RAWs for the images that demand color, and it's a very colorful place. So I'm gonna shoot some more stuff today on the streets, and um, yeah, come with me for that ride.
and we're now at uh, the Shibui Crossing, which you can probably see behind me. If I just raise it up a little bit, you'll see it. And it's, um, it's sort of, I've actually been here several times before, and it's an amazing and crazy place. Uh, it's Saturday afternoon today, so it's actually a little bit quieter, but I think the best time to come here is kind of like in the evenings, on the weekends, or maybe during rush hour. Every single time one of the trains come through Shibui Crossing, they, uh, sorry, when they come to the train station, like something like 8,000 people come out of the station at the same time and they all cross at the same time. And it's quite an amazing thing to see. So uh, we're coming to the end of our trip in Japan, Tokyo. Um, Bert and I have just had a beer, the last couple of beers. Uh, we both have very early flights in the morning. I have My flight, I think, is at 9 a.m., something like that. And I need to get to the airport by 6. And it's about an hour on the train, all kinds of stuff. So very early start for us in the morning. Um, it's been a fun trip, of course. Uh, we're now back in Shibui, actually. Um, we walked down here, walked, I don't know, something like feels like about 25,000 steps on the, the demo tour today. Um, we're going to wrap up, we're going to head back to the hotel. Um, I'm going to download some cards, Bert's going to download some cards because I've got some of his videos on my camera. He's got some of my videos on his camera. Uh, we'll get all that good stuff done. Um, as always, please do subscribe to the channel, like it, share it, all that good stuff. Leave any comments below. Uh, thank you once again for tuning in and I shall see you when I am back in the UK next week. Take care.